friends i am ajay karmarka before starting further i would like to tell you something please watch video completely and see it with copy pen if you find somewhere important then pause the video and note it and proceed further and although you have facing any problem or difficulties then please write in comment box i will definitely solve your problem and along with please like share and subscribe my channel that will give me energy thank you <clears throat> what this is the question a large spherical mass capital m is fixed at one position and two identical point masses small m are kept on a line passing through the center of capital m the point masses are connected by a rigid mass less ro uh, less rod of length small l and this assembly is free to move along the line connecting them all three masses interact only through their mutual gravitational interaction when two point masses near to capital m is at a distance r equal to 3l from capital m the tension in the rod is zero for m equal to k into capital m by 288 then find the value of k now let us think about this question here we have given three rigid body here the bigger body having the mass capital m and this is point object having the identical mass small m and the distance from the first uh, rigid body at this point object that is r equal to 3l and for the second is a uh, l here we have find out attraction force between this body and this body that is g capital n small n upon r square its a direction is uh, towards to the bigger body and here the smaller two point objects its attraction force towards to the right side it means net force f1 is equal to g capital n small m upon r square minus g n square because n into m and the distance is l square here we have given value of r is a 3l square g m square on l square right so here f1 equal to g capital m small m 9 l square minus g m square upon l square right it is the first condition and for the second condition now here we have find out the attraction force for the bigger point to this point and attraction force to this point because this is the same direction so therefore we have to taking here addition so now f2 equal to g capital n small n and the distance whole distance it is 3l and l now it become 4l square plus why we have taken here plus because the direction is the same okay so here g m square and uh, l square okay so here f1 and f2 now in this case here f1 equal to f2 okay why this f1 and f2 are equal because they are mutual interactions and so therefore they are equal so now comparing g capital m small m 9 l square minus g small m square l square equal to g capital m small m 4l square and plus g n square and l square solving this term by transposing the terms g capital n small n get common l square get common then 1 by 9 minus 1 by 16 equal to g m square upon l square g m square upon l square is two times so therefore 2 g small n square by l square one small n and this m cancel out l square l square cancel out capital g capital g cancel out m taking the lcm 144 and 16 minus 9 and equal to 2 m okay so here m 16 minus 9 means 7 and 144 and this two transposing and going to the denominators then it become 288 small m now compare with our given terms m equal to k capital m 288 now k equal to 7 i hope so you understood this problem thank you thank you for staying till the end of this video and i re remind you please like share and subscribe my channel thank you bye bye take care